Hi everyone. I have a poem today by Lucille Clifton, who is an amazing poet, and I can't believe I haven't read anything by her yet. But it's I'm reading it from this collection called Blessing the Boats, which is just her uh, new and selected poems from 1990, 1988 to 2000. And this poem I'm going to read today is called Blessing the Boats, and it's from her 1991 collection called Quilting. And I just think this poem is really beautiful and can be applied to a lot of situations. Um, I think it can be, I mean, I think I see death in this poem. I see hope. I see all of these different ways that I can apply this poem to our lives and I can definitely apply it to our lives right now. And so I'd actually been thinking about this poem for a while, but I just hadn't shared it yet. So here it is. It's called Blessing the Boats by Lucille Clifton. And uh, it is the, at the top of the poem, it's at St. Mary's. And I looked into St. Mary's and that's a college in Maryland where she would teach. And I guess this poem is referring to a uh, tradition at the college where they, uh, some sort of ceremony where they bless the boats um, in the river in front of the college. And so Lucille Clifton taught at that college. She uh, died in 2010. She's a really amazing African-American poet. I learned about her in a class that I took a couple years ago. So here's the poem, Blessing the Boats by Lucille Clifton. May the tide that is entering even now, the lip of our understanding, carry you out beyond the face of fear. May you kiss the wind, then turn from it, certain that it will love your back. May you open your eyes to water, water waving forever. And may you, in your innocence, sail through this to that. So may you all sail through this to that someday. I hope you have had a great day and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.